Cause you have the fire and I've got the spark Hello guys, so tumefika kwa nyumba and uh, I came here with Esther. Of course Esther is not her real name. We will use Esther as your name for just to protect your privacy. And also tumemvalisha kofia shades and uh, mask so that we can also protect your dignity. Maybe until unless you feel like you are uko sawa to show out your face. So Esther, thank you so much for coming. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Okay. So Esther, to me, Kuana, we have been having a lot of ladies to Kiwamba. Maybe they should come with us. Wengine wana kata, wengine wana kubali, but at to Kiwamba wengine kwa gari wana kata. What made you come with us? So for the first time, mm -hmm. so you're just a safe man. Mm -hmm. uh, I could just drive with you here, mm -hmm. and uh, I think meeting you. I know after this, we're gonna, I'm gonna have some money just to spend on. So money. Yeah. So money was a good motivation for you coming here. Yeah, of course. This yeah. is Kenya. <clears throat> of course. To look at me agree with Esther that if she gives me just 40 minutes of her life, I would pay you 10k. Yeah. So about to me agree? I sana. And uh, the reason why I want 40 minutes of her life, I am thinking, eh? I wanted to show you Christ and maybe speak to you about God. And uh, maybe at the end of this, maybe you'll give your life to Christ. That is my prayer. First of all, unamjua mungu? Of course, everyone knows God. Even Satan himself, mm -hmm. anajua mungu. Hata shetani anajua mungu. Yeah. <clears throat> nice. So, wo umiokoka? Ama unenda kanisa, ama kuna kugaje? Ama umisilimu? Okay, I can't say I'm born again. Mm -hmm. But let's say I know God. Mm -hmm. I know he still exists. Mm -hmm. But... Because mm -hmm. you know, it's being like mm -hmm. being to Christ. Yeah. So let's mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, But if you insist and you give me, I've always looking for that man or that woman. When mm -hmm. woman is scared, like, okay, this is Christ that I'm serving. But I couldn't tell my kunikujia kaniambia. Okay, uni mungu, this is what, this is what, this is blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. I love I accepted God. Okay. So I'm always eager. Mm. Waiting for that man or that woman who will show up and tell me you should you should just be born again. You should you you share. You mm -hmm. should do this. You should do this. Yeah. And uh, maybe just to kuenda nyuma kidogo. Do you know the purpose of me giving you the twenty before to to endele? Okay. The purpose of giving me that ten k. Mm -hmm. I'm sure it's because of. Okay, per day. Mm -hmm. Of course, when you meet with a man. Mm -hmm. The regular man, mm. I'm so. Mm -hmm. So, so Billy. Yeah, so Billy. So Billy, ni ni ni. So Billy, see you just, you know the thing. Mm. Yeah, the fact. Mm. But if you meet with a. Yeah, in other words, uh, short. Una sama short amount sama ni. Yeah, for for one shot. Two hundred. Yeah, regular man. Uh, the reason I'm I'm giving you the ten k. It is not for you, okay. That is Nilwantaka Kwanza ku set up you straight. Mm. It is for you coming here, giving me forty minutes of your of your life. You also so to make Bali and Apo Kwanza. Will you gonna have killed ten king? Of course, I don't get an enemy. You thought me in attack. Yeah, of course you are cute. <laughs> So, I'd like that and k to enter into my pocket. Mm. You are good, you are good looking. Mm. Then you look expensive, you know. So I was sure of that. I see shit. Like Goja. You thought the ten K is for me to sleep with you. That is what you Yeah, mean. Up. Mm. And not only f up, but f me so well. <laughs> okay. Missouri to speak out will you know yeah. But I want your 40 minutes eh, so that I could talk to you about God, about Christ, and about heaven. Na vile unafawish maisha kwa pa duniani. Kwa za before tufike hapo, umenambia ati unalipisha miambili what? Short moja tu. Short moja. Moja ata. Ata kwa za kupikisha short moja ni nusu tu na kulipisha miambili. And for those maybe who don't understand short short ni nusu. Like you are going to bed, mm -hmm. then you are short two more. Mm -hmm. And that's 
ni kwa regular man ule mtoto na akaa tu ako tu ako tu yani okay but to I'm people getting... like those who look rich mm-hmm. those with cars mm-hmm. out are to 15 that is short moja but Fi- for 15 s- what 15 ah 1500 uh-huh. but for someone like you mpaka mwenye nikaitikia tukuje kwa gari tukuje mpaka hapa uh-huh. i was sure you're going to pay me 10k because you already told me that uh-huh. but to my own surprise uh-huh. to my you are see i did not want us to see uh, i feel like going home <laughs> <laughs> i feel like leaving that work uh, maybe nataka nikuulize because pia umekubali nikufanya interview ni nini ilikufanya ukaingia kwa hii kazi? Okay. Tukiangalia tu ukweli because mm-hmm. we are here to speak the reality. Mm-hmm. Uh, I was in campus. Mm-hmm. And I joined a group mwenye mm-hmm. wenye tulikuwa tunaenda to hang out. Of course napenda raha. Mm-hmm. And we used to go and drink. We used to go and do what for do what do it. Mm-hmm. But because of my family background, mm-hmm. hatungeza kufanya hiyo yote ni pesa. Cuz a week we would spend like almost 20k that is less. Mm-hmm. Kwenda ku hang out, kwenda kukunywa nini 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 mm-hmm. and my friend would afford. Mm-hmm. But nigejeka kwa hiyo kiatu then ijionyeshe naweza afford. Mm-hmm. But due to time, of course mnaenanga 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 singeza ku afford. Mm. So Nikona for the first time a man came mm-hmm. a sponsor let's call him Babas Babas MZ then he was like I can pay you everything mm-hmm. I can keep your good life mm-hmm. I can do anything and for the first time I was like ah this man would I go in bed with an old man like this mm-hmm. then I was like because you just pay my things he got there we slept mm-hmm. and for the first time my impressor read 30k mm-hmm. and he told me that mm-hmm. it's just for fair you going back to school mm-hmm. it's nothing to me but then i would pay you uh, hostels nini 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 mm-hmm. then i was like happy so mulikutana tena you met again no for the last time he just told me mm-hmm. of course i'm having this and this mm-hmm. i will just send you 60k mm-hmm. then we'll be off usiniongeleshane mm-hmm. usiongeleshe mm-hmm. then i was like 60k It's okay. I used it, I used it. Of course, <coughs> money jai tosha. Yeah. Sasa unajua hivyo, mm-hmm. pesa jai tosha. Mm-hmm. Then uh, nika nikaamua tu, nikaenda nikamtinda tu kalianza anza. Mm-hmm. Love I just found myself in the streets. Mm-hmm. Wearing short clothes. Mm-hmm. Wearing things like a seduction, you know. Mm-hmm. That. You can tell I want that. And he, and here. Yeah. So this guy you never met again. No. No. Hata nisome simju yangu atajena na njua tu mbaba sinikuleza nime meet na mtu basi ah friend with a mbaba. Yeah. So in other words you are saying that the people who introduced you to this uh, should you call it uh, it ikitu <coughs> prostitution was um ni peer pressure. Yeah. Ni friends. Of course. In campus. Yeah. First year, second year, third year, fourth year. Huh. Kwa ngeo kweli imagine it was first year. First yeah? First year. Of course I'm that girl, I'm a lady mm-hmm. mwenye napendanga ku deal out with people who are mature than me. Mm-hmm. So nili mimi si kuingia tinaanza ku pressure up with mm-hmm. first years. Mm-hmm. So mimi nilienda to the second and the third class and the fourth a much even. Mm-hmm. So yeah. So maybe we should recap kidogo how is life at uh, kwa ka- campus? Wow. Uh, okay, mimi nimesomea KU mm-hmm. for the first year. Mm-hmm. And that's where as young we are to be by KU ya Kenyatta University. Ah, hii tu moja. Kwa nini kuna KU nyingine? Ni niambiwa hakuna masofu KU. The first year ni production ushajua. What? That's true. But that that's true. First year and uh, you are busy having men. Yeah, not mm-hmm. men, uh, but barbers and the sponsors <coughs> thing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But pia wao walikuwa introduced walikuwa introduced na kina nani ama tukiongea yeah. kweli let's talk to my part cuz me part yangu ni najua mm-hmm. how i felt like being mm-hmm. with people mm-hmm. who can afford mm-hmm. and i myself cannot afford mm-hmm. let's say hata how maybe walikuwa mm-hmm. na deal na maswansa and the rest mm-hmm. but i didn't know ndio kwanza ni wana 
wanapewa na familia manini mm. so but i needed that money mm. kujeka hiyo class yeah. like i want to be that class i want to be going hanging out mm-hmm. dancing na kukatiwa and feel like oh i'm high yeah and uh, the reason for you for doing this was all motivated by money of course only money a correct thing money no sexual desire sama <coughs> of course sex desire is also there mm-hmm. hata tukienda club of course utamit tu na mtu mdanza like i'm feeling honey i want to f- <coughs> then you're like yeah f- me yeah that's like right. you're not afraid uh, of uh, the diseases in school kwinje no of course what i'm afraid of is sdis mm-hmm. more than aids Uh, it's like, let's say the mimba. ARVs. Yeah. Ah, mimba. No, I have the family planning. Yeah. Even back five years late. So you you mimba. Of mimba kushinda HIV. Mimba mbaya. Imagine nikileta mtoto hapa atanaza kumuonyesha life, alafu unapata pesa. Alafu mimi wa ni student tu, alafu namleta pesa zaka. Ni nini ya sasa? Mm. I love my child. Nasingependa apitie hii life na apitie ya sai. So, ukona so I'm afraid. Huh? How many kids do you have? Ah, after <coughs> do you have the family planning? Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, utaki mtoto nimekushika nime sasa. Ah. And uh, ni nini ina kumotivate like just only money always after any other job, any other business? Just the truth. I would like a decent job for me. Mm-hmm. I would like to be wearing suits, mm-hmm. going to office, mm-hmm. going to a decent job. Na ni nini nakuzuia? Ni life. Mm-hmm. Life in Kenya is so hard mm-hmm. to cope up with. Mhm. I like by then ningependa tunaenda kwa company I'm working there as a sec- I'm working there as a good person mm. but like venye nanipeleka mimi <coughs> si venye nilikuwa nafikiria you know those things that we are told with our mamas mm-hmm. just read you go somewhere just mm-hmm. read you go somewhere but there I worked hard mm-hmm. in high school mm-hmm. and I moved with a good grade mm-hmm. that's why I joined KU campus mm-hmm. But due to the peer pressure I want money mm-hmm. and always your parents at the parents uncle who want here we want you to bring something good mm-hmm. in our family mm-hmm. we want money we want this and this and this mm-hmm. sio tunaambia yangu yeah. yeah that's what I always want no kipata kazi maybe someone is watching hapa na angependa maybe kupatia kazi ni which type of ulisomea nini by the way by the way mimi nimesomea mostly of manager mm-hmm. managing businesses uh-huh. uh, so you are you're a good business manager yeah even when i was in high school mm-hmm. after the classes and the thing mm-hmm. the closing of school the mid terms i was so serious with my studies so mm-hmm. what i did i used to go to the online classes mm-hmm. i read about managing business mm-hmm. secretary nini 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 mm-hmm. so when i went to campus i want forecast i want this i want this i want a good job i want a good mm-hmm. money a paying good job sasa hizi uko umemaliza ama bado uko shule ah sio kuambia ni kulienda i want this and this and this so oh, lakini pesa ika ikaleta shida so you are una, unaendelea lakini for now you're not mhm maybe mtu ako pale anataka maybe kumwandika kazi Um, nitaweka hapa namba yangu because nikikupatia niki namba yake i know a lot of people will disturb you kuna namba tutaweka hapa or you can dm us on uh, our instagram page uh, at the narams nitaka hapa chini maybe if you are there you unataka kumreach out ama kumsaidia in any way uh, just go and dm us on instagram ni kwa sure maybe someone is there nataka kupea kazi <coughs> unaweza toka kwa street kabisa because mimi the reason why i asked you to come here and i'm even uh, using my time kukuja kuongelesha leo nimetoka nyumbani and i was asking god that nipate just one person kwa street mwenye maybe naweza mkaisha chini ni muongeleshe anisikie na ajue that there is god in heaven mwenye anampenda sana mimi naweza furai sana nikikuchukulia kama dada yangu nikikuona kesho maybe uko pale umeenda kwa kazi you are, you are a manager somewhere and uh, <coughs> maisha yako inaendelea ningependa sana that your life be like that uh, i used to say in Mombasa some time back some like uh, six years ago and i remember i was a missionary there in Mombasa and i remember i used to even uh, kuongelesha the prostitutes in Mombasa pale mtu hapa and kulikuwa na msichana alikuwa anaitwa Eunice mmoja pale Mombasa you know the real name Eunice if you are seeing this 
contact me na that lady ali change after nilimongelesha akokoka her life changed kabisa ikabadilika i'm here today kukuambia that your life can change your life si lazima iko pale kwa street pale kwa street kuna vitu mingi sana there are a lot of things that can happen so i'm just here kukuambia that god loves you so much god cares about you god has a plan for you I don't know if you feel you are I don't know Korwako if you can feel that God loves you so much he cares about you that is why I'm spending this night up up nimeacha nyumba hivyo nimetoka nimekuja hapa just to get this one soul to Christ and I know God loves you so much God loves you so much Mungu anakupenda sana my sister nataka kukuona kesho kesho kutwa we, we talk more and uh, today i'll ask you by the conviction of the holy spirit i would really love eh, that the same god jesus christ who died on the cross for you and for me mimi nilikuwa msemba sana by the way my past life it was it was not different than yours unashika but god alinionea huruma kanitoa huko kwa street unaelewa akanitoa huko what i was doing hizo vitu zote no one sins more than the other hakuna <coughs> hakuna dhambi kubwa kushinda nyingine so usijua that when mchafu zaidi kushinda wengine god loves you the, the way you are and uh, nitakwambia that jesus died on the cross for you uh, john 3:16 says for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever believes in him it's okay unaweza panguza machozi ni shida that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life ni nini kwa roho yako una regret most is there anything that you una regret most as na regretting the kind of plan i say mhm okay giving my body to people that's not so yani si poa no na kupewa watu mwili yako then like it's everybody is using you you know and you maybe in the future or like a daughter or a son yeah. to grow up so well mm. and maybe a kujana reflect my shango be crying mm. this is not the life that i wanted mm. i wanted a good life then you know it's so bad it's so hurting you know umetaja hiyo umetaja kitu mpaka nime feel like unasema about your future daughter nini and i just want to say When I look back kwa life yangu a lot has happened so much eh na mimi nimekuja kulearn kitu moja that there is a god in heaven who cares a god who has a plan for for you for me na when you unaanza kufikiria about your future your future kids that is when when I hit the mind that it is time for us to change it is time for you to move away from from the street my dear viewers <coughs> if you are there and you are able kumpatia kazi i think that is the only thing ni za kuombea hata si pesa ma kitu yote if you are there and you are able kumpatia kazi please msaidie msaidie but the guys mm-hmm. me is not all about money mm-hmm. me is not about all things mm-hmm. me if i got ningepata tu a decent job mm-hmm. ningefanya ninge passionately mm-hmm. that i could afford my everything yani naweza ji afford ya kila kitu sio lazima ti i go to ni ene kwa mwanaume anifanye hivi na hivi mm-hmm. but if i could just afford my own money nijikalishe i be an independent like i could provide everything for myself mm-hmm. ningekuwa tu okay mm-hmm. yeah yeah my friends if you are there na god is touching god is speaking to you tokeni nje tafadhali tokeni nje kujeni huku usiku mchukue hawa wasichana muwapatie kazi tokeni nje i don't even want to continue with this but nitakuuliza would you love to give your life to christ okay me but i have never thought of giving my life to christ mm-hmm. because of the things i do mm-hmm. mostly na just can i tell you something what's the kwambie nikukatishe umesema you have never thought of giving your life to Christ because of the things you 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 do yeah. do you know 
that God, Jesus became sin for us, for for the sake of our sins. Like he became our sin. That kila mtu wa mesin, and has fallen short of the glory of God, na yeshu wakakua dhambi for us. So, we are not saved by our own righteousness. We are not saved by utakatifu wetu. The Bible says that our righteousness is as filthy rags. Let me tell you. You might think I'm so righteous. But you know everything you mean of fanya, those righteous acts, even sitting you here, they are as filthy rags before God. We are the righteousness of God through Christ. So usiona that like maybe umeamoko koka alafu kesho ukajipata maybe umerudi kwa street ama umefanya kitu kama hiyo that ujiokoka umenelewa. Bado umeokoka it's just a, it's a it's a journey. It's a journey unaacha. Unaona? Una decide uache na una na unaacha. So I ask you, would you love to give your life to Christ? I think I should. Nataka uamue kutoka kwa roho yako isikue nimekuforce. I want you to if you're not ready just tell me si sahi. But if you think in your heart you want it right now, just say. Yes. Yeah, I think it's a long time since mm-hmm. I cried the tears of adjusting I want to give myself to Christ. And I'm so glad. I'm then, so glad. I'm so glad that he he talk and he could have a street tonight. No, I can't Just believe I was reason. doing things that when I approached you nearly feel you are the right person. <laughs> it's okay. You don't have to cry. I want you to repeat this. No ko una umanishe kuokoka ni kukeri Yesu kama mkozi umesha yako na deciding that from today on swag ni I'll try my best not to be on the streets. Yeah. Mela. Mm. Sisi as a person I'll try my best. Najua unahitaji chakula, unahitaji hizo vitu zote. I'll try my best, but I I am sure our viewers our viewers are seeing. Na God in heaven is seeing na chakula utapata. Amen. Kuna mtu kwa Biblia alikuwa analishwa na wakikiwa wanasema na roho yake. <laughs> roho yake na Kiswahili ama Kizungu ni Raven. Kuna mtu there is a person in the Bible who has been fed by a raven. God will send you a raven. Amen. So just say Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Welcome to my heart. Welcome to my heart. I am a sinner. I am a sinner. I repent all my sins. I repent all my sins. And I turn to you. And I turn to you. Forgive me. Forgive me. Kwanza leo. Kwanza leo. I'm born again. I'm born again. You are my Lord and Savior. You are my Lord and Savior. Amen. 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 I am so joyful as I can. Amen. I can't even believe that finally today was not a bad day. Today was a good day. Yeah. You've done something. That is the best choice you have ever made. That is the best choice she has ever made in her life. God. Thank you, God. Thank you. Maybe today I should dedicate this to to my daughters. Hmm? Na wapenda sana. Sana. And I pray that God will be with you forever. And I love you so much. Sana. My daughters. Na wapenda sana. I'm speechless. I don't know what to do. Or what to say. It's okay. It shall be well with you. It shall be well. My dear viewers, if you are new to this channel, kindly subscribe. You are watching the L and N Inspire Show, where we try to connect and inspire our viewers and our listeners and our guests. Leo siko najua that we would have, uh, in quotes, Esther as our guest tonight. Thank you so much for even Kukubali that you will be with us here. And I, as I promised, eh, for giving me your 40 minutes. Now you see 40 minutes. Ni the kanga pisai. 24. Ya hata jafika 40. But I will still honor my promise. I will still honor my promise, and we are we are going to do our follow ups, and God shall bless you. Tena sana. So to kitu kilo kapa, you will give me your number, and uh, I'll impress you that 10 Kenya to put me agree. When the two ones alive. Hmm? Oh, is there anything you want to say? No. No. Hmm? No. I connect to the taxi. 
don't want any money from me. I'm good. Hmm? Then 10k I said, for sure, and fish it. But mm -hmm. I don't want the shit again. I want to give my life to God. You're saying you don't want my 10k. <laughs> I don't want that. I don't want to go back to that life. I am happy that money is not the motivation for you. No. God, thank you so much. God, I'm so happy, you know. I'm rejoicing. I don't know how to end this one. Only subscribe, press that like, and... What? See you in the next video. Cause you have the fire and I've got the spark